The Mariners' opening day is in three days, and 9,000 fans are expected at the sold-out game. And there are some changes fans are walking into T-Mobile Park, and that they'll need to hear about. Key 13's Jennifer Lee has a look tonight. We're really, we're really excited. The Mariners are back on Thursday night, and fans like Bryn Whitehouse stop by the team store to pick up a couple special items to showcase their team spirit. I didn't think we were going to get a ticket, but you know, it really works out. White House is going to the game on Friday night, which is sold out along with the rest of the weekend. The safety and security of our fans and our team members is always our top priority. The director of security at T-Mobile Park walked us through some new safety guidelines. Gates open two hours before the game to encourage social distancing. Tickets are all digital, and after a quick scan, fans will walk in through new metal detectors. We purchased new metal detectors for this season. Uh, the new units have enhanced features that allow fans to now leave their cell phones and their keys and their wallets in their pockets, um, so they don't have to remove those items. T-Mobile Park is issuing a no-bag policy, with the exception of a small clutch, medical, or diaper bag. But if you do end up bringing a bag that you want to stow away in a safe place, we're hearing from stadium workers that new lockers will be installed. Just look for home plate and they'll be right across the street. Sometimes it feels like it's a little over the top, some of the protocols, but you've got to understand like times like this, you know, people are dying, people are getting sick. Um, and, you know, they've got to do what they've got to do. And also to protect themselves, to protect the public. The director of security says that's what her team will do. She shows us some of the dangerous items that were confiscated from fans in 2019 and says the new guidelines will protect everyone while limiting cross-contamination. So fans walking into T-Mobile Park can focus on baseball. The whole experience, you know, the enjoyment of that and just, you know, going back to that, it's, it's special, you know, it, it's just special. In Seattle, Jennifer Lee, Q13 News.